I have an earlier comment on the Baofeng radios, and I thought I'd offer an update. Maker Fair is a, an exposition for do-it-yourselfers that's held around the country, and I live in the San Francisco Bay Area, so Maker Fair has happened here at the San Mateo uh, Exposition Arena. While I'm there, a group of hams and I get together, and we set up a mobile HF station and demonstrate HF and UHF and VHF radio while we're at Maker Fair and try to entice people into becoming hams. A lot of people express interest but won't commit and I always ask what is it that your tipping point? What could I tell you that would make you become a ham radio operator? So a couple of guys dropped by. One of them had no interest in being a ham and the other one had an interest and I said, you know, what is it that I could tell you that would get you into ham radio? And he said, well, I can't afford it. And I said, what if I told you I can get you into ham radio for 80 bucks? And he said, well, I understand I can take the test and pass it, but then you've got to buy the equipment. And I said, no, no, 80 bucks. I'll get you into ham radio license and equipment for 80 bucks. And his brain seized. He couldn't grasp it. It did not compute. 80 bucks for the total whole shebang locked his mind up tight. And his friend started laughing at him. I mean, it was clear on his face that he couldn't come to grips with being a ham with equipment for 80 bucks. There are ham cram courses offered in the Bay Area, and I had a sheet for one from one of our local guys who does the course. So I showed him the sheet, and you pay $30 for materials and the license test. And you go in about 8 o'clock in the morning. They spend until 4 o'clock teaching you everything you need to know to, take, to pass the test. They give you the test at 4. And this guy has a pass rate that's over 90%. So you take the test on Saturday. You pass it. You have, you have your FCC license on Monday. So I told the guy, you know, here's the sheet. It's 30 bucks and you'll have your ham license. Then I said, how much is this radio? And he couldn't figure it out, and his friend was laughing at him. John, John, it's 50 bucks. John, 80 minus 30, it's 50. And John wasn't getting it. He just, his brain just wasn't working with that concept of $80. And I said, this is a $50 radio. I paid $50 for it. It's three watts, but it's two bands, 70 centimeter and two meters. It's a ham radio for 50 bucks. And his face lighted up, you know, it dawned on him. It finally sank in. $30 for the test, 50 bucks for the radio, and he's a ham with all his gear. So I've stopped handing out paper at Maker Faire because it just goes somewhere. I pay for it out of pocket. So I either have, I have QR codes and I put the URLs on, the, on a piece of paper. So he took a photograph of the, of the sheet of paper with the ham cram course on it. And he took a picture of the Baofeng radio. And I think we've got a ham there based on an $80 total cost of entry. I'm very happy about that.